What's going on, everybody? Welcome to G Myers World. And right here, we're going to be going up against the limited time Steve McNair. I'm going to tell you this right now, bro. That dude, he doesn't fumble the ball. And I don't know if that's something new or if EA just wanted to make him the toughest quarterback ever to play in the game ever. But the dude does not fumble the ball, which is why I tried him out like maybe a month ago. You guys can see those gameplays right here at G Myers World. And I just said, you know what? I'm done with him, bro. Because the dude is garbage and he can't really throw the ball as deep as I need. Um, you know, so I had to just get rid of him, bro. The dude is gar Oh, he, 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 what, what is he doing? Why wouldn't he throw that? I don't know what this guy was doing right there. That didn't really make much sense. I don't understand why he just stood there all right but it is what it is we're gonna get out to a very very fast start in this game and um we're gonna screw us oh yo run for six run for six run for six that was just a bad play by him this guy is top two i think he was like number two when i uh when i played him but i beat him earlier in the year and um he tried to wager me to like a 200 dollars game on uh gamer saloon like what are you, are you serious bro like i don't know what these guys are doing but it, it's it's it comes down to the fact that you know later in the year you know, after patches happen and things like that, the game changes. So, obviously, we know the high pass is still something that's regular. Guys come out in tight and they'll just throw a high pass seam streak on a regular basis and your guy won't jump. That's just something that happens. There's no reaction to it. Um, in order to play that, you really have to sometimes uh, man them up and be over there. And then sometimes that doesn't even work. Um, so, it is what it is, bro. The bottom line is that's something that a lot of guys are going to take advantage of is that seam streak. And that's pretty much what's going to... Um, you know, drill me in the anal cavity in this game. Like, I'm not going to go ahead and sugarcoat it. You know what I'm saying? The dude's going to come out right here. What the hell is Matt? Is Matt Ryan serious? What is he doing? I don't understand what, what that was about. But look, we go up 10 zip. Um, we we kind of figure, right? Look, listen, we just got to maintain. But, you know, he was he started to make those moves like that. You see like how he stepped up in the pocket? We, we were sending the pressure right there. He just steps up, throws the ball. I don't know why my, my, my defender was so far away from the ball because pretty much these are the C routes from the tight, and you got to wait for the cut to happen. And then sometimes he had the drag going. They're right there. I thought, you know, well, he had position on that. He probably should have caught that. But, you know, with other Maddens, you could probably step up while you're strafing and go and pick it. But it's very, very hard to have that control, um, which is something that I think that they're working on for Madden 18. We'll see what happens with that. But the bottom line is you really lose control of your player in the secondary when you try to click on. Right here, look how close he is. And he's like, about to hit me with it right there. I got my dudes backing up, but they don't react. The high pass and the seam streak, you, you're not, listen, you're not going to get a reaction from it. So don't worry about it. And then with these animations where you can't really beat somebody deep, it wasn't, okay, that, that's a pick. He had, it was man and a uh, purple, and I just threw it. That was straight Stevie Wonder read status. Um, right there, he just throwing the ball while he's getting hit. There's no, nothing I can do about that. If the dude is throwing the ball while I'm bashing him in his neck, there's nothing I can do about it. I just got to deal with that like a man, bro. But that, that that's pretty much how he was getting his scores on. And, um... You know, I had to figure out, like, all right, what are we doing here? We had to hit him with a swerve right there. You know, exclamation point TSG, if you in the chat. Um, we had to go ahead and swerve on him. You already know we're going to swerve on him, but the way he was playing the swerve, and, the way, like, sometimes when you when you play this game, right, and you know, like, the coverage, because, like, if you're throwing the swerve, obviously you have to throw the, slow, the, the swerve a little bit differently if it's man or zone. If you don't know that, then you just learned it, and it's so late in the year. Hopefully you could go out and swerve somebody's panties off um, and make them rage, but... If it's man, it's a different type of swerve. If it's zone, it's, it's just the mechanics of trying to do it. Um, a lot of you may have watched Voltarax play over the weekend with the Madden Challenge. You know, he played Young Kiv, just swerving out of his mind. Um, it is what it is. But you have to know, you have to understand and adapt to the swerve. You, you, this, is the, this is the key. You have to respect the swerve, else the swerve will hurt you, bro. You got to know what you're doing with it. Um, and as far as that goes, with the way he was playing it, I had to adjust it. But Deion Sanders was just a nightmare, bro. Oh, wow, wow. Yeah, he, he got me on that. He got me on that because he's running around. As soon as he hikes the ball, he's running around in the circle behind the line of scrimmage. And then, oh, what the hell? Yo, Deion Sanders swerved. He went with the swerve and came right back. I've never seen... Yo, only Deion Sanders can do that, bro. Only Deion Sanders can do that kind of action, bro. The dude got swerved out of his freaking jeans and just came right back like he wasn't swerved. I, I Look, I have no comment on that. You know what I'm saying? Other than Deion Sanders is the greatest. And then right there, he just started overthrowing everybody. Who's my quarterback right there? Oh, that's Matty Dry Ice. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. I don't know why I ever picked him up anyway. Right there, I was just trying to swerve, and there was no swerving happening, bro. Dude was just all over. Why did everybody just come in on that play? What was that? Why did everybody just come right in on a dual edge heat? Looked like it was 4-4. He just sent everybody, but whatever. It looked kind of pretty. Um, So, you know, looking at the way that this game was going, you guys can see I was up 10 zip. And then he just realized that as soon as he hikes the ball, he has to start running. Why did he run back like that and not go to go pick the ball? Did I, I must have had him in a spy. He probably was in a spy, but he was in a dumb spy. He was in the kind of spy where he didn't want to play any D. Yeah, fumble the ball out of bounds, bro. F not running for six, too. Running for six. Um, I think he's he going to score a touchdown right here. Yeah, yeah, good, good, good doubt, good doubt. 
Uh, he's right there. And if for some reason, my QB sneak D just wasn't working. I don't know what it is about Steve McNair, but I have a lot of difficulty playing this guy. This guy just does everything the right way. But it's, what, whoa, what, what? That, should, that was a Stevie Wonder read, but why, why wasn't that? Why am I throwing that over there in the double coverage? Why is Deion Sanders jumping out of nowhere, picking the ball every goddamn time? Yo, wait a minute. Why is that other guy just running straight up the field in that? What's, what D was I in? He's just running straight up the field. Yo, I don't know what D I'm in, bro, but that guy is mad stupid. He's just running by himself with nobody over there just running straight up the field. Why is he doing that? I, I don't know what's going on. I just kind of looked at it. Um, oh, whoa, 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 bro. Okay. He's going to come right in like that. Yo, who is that? Ball physics. Why is that guy playing such aggressive defense? Who is that cornerback, bro? The dude is punching me in the chest all the way up the field. It's no... Oh, now I'm going to get... Yeah, it was nothing open. It's nothing, this dude is playing man-to-man -man coverage, though. I, I, yo, Randy Moss, take it for six. Go ahead. We had to put Randy Moss over there because for some reason, Julio Jones can't burn anybody. So we had to put we had to put Randy Moss over there to get... Got, yo. Oh, my goodness, man. He's so expensive, and the dude does not burn anyone. The funny thing about it is I have slower wide receivers like Vincent Jackson and Brandon Marshall. That was getting more separation than Julio Jones. And he was maxed out with all the chems. And he still couldn't burn anybody deep. I don't know what the... Why was there nobody there on 39? Why would I not stay with the only... I knew... Oh, he go keep doing it. The high pass, bro. Like, that. that's what I'm saying, guys. I might have to put out a tutorial on how to stop that because it's starting to piss me off. And, like, whenever I realized that he's doing it... See, I should have been playing it and I got the D to play it. I just didn't play it. I just was like, you know what? This dude is garbage and uh, I'm just going to keep doing whatever I want to do. And that's just my mentality with anyone I play. doesn't matter how good they are. That should have been a fumble. But it doesn't really matter how good they are. You know what I'm saying? And this dude's getting hit stick. And then it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Yo, this... Did, did he just float that ball in the air like that for like 30 minutes? And then it just came down right to the guy's lap? All right, cool. Um, yeah, so what, what is it right now? It's 31-25. All we got to do really is just score. We got to score. Our defense can hold them. We just got to make sure that we understand. Okay, we finally got a decent swerve off. We finally got a decent swerve, man. Yo, we just had this swerve on this boy. Like, this dude is really fighting the swerve, man. How is he fighting the strength of like 7,000 tornadoes? Why was that guy open? Oh, probably because he motioned the motion around. Hmm. And then you got a delay now because EA doesn't want you to start right. Bruh, they didn't give me an animation. That's Anthony Barr right there. That was Anthony Barr. I went, I lurked it underneath to pick it. And then this guy, just, he, he's swiping his hand out instead of trying to pick it. Um, but yeah, that last one right there where he threw the high pass, that's realistically how you defend it the way that I had it, the defense I was playing. But for some reason, they didn't give me an animation. That really hurt me this game. You know what I'm saying? If I get that animation and get that pick, this game is over. But, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. That's just what happens. Sometimes your defender is not going to give you that animation, and you got to deal with it. And right here, we're just going to get picked off again right quick. Oh, we're never going to get there. Are you serious? Yo. Mm. Mm. Yo. That one, yo, that was just a Stevie Wonder read, man. That, I, I'm not even going to even comment on the fact that I threw that. Who is, who is that running back? Oh, is that is that good one? Okay, and then I just swipe through the through the balls. Okay, all right. So throw throw a dot right here. Yeah, yeah. Good good job. Good job. Yeah, yeah. This one is over. This one's over. Oh, you, this was running QB draws because he knows that Steve McNair will never fumble, bro. Not on his worst day. Yo, not even on his worst day will this guy ever fumble. I'm getting flooded, bro. Did he catch that? He caught that? Oh, he caught it. I don't know why he caught that. I'm down by nine though. Like, does that really matter that he caught that? Okay, okay, he's gonna drop that. See, those kind of catches, they really toned him down for Madden 16. Those were always catches in Madden 16. You know what I'm saying? So I could see that EA is trying to stop the ridiculousness, but um, there's a lot of, yo, what, what is this? What's what's this? What's going on right now? Oh, that's Montgomery. That's not a good one. That's, oh, that, oh Montgomery. Uh, what the, f okay. Oh, that's the way the cookie crumbles, bro. That's the way the cookie crumbles, bro. Just, yo, close your eyes. Close your, this one's over. This one's over, guys. Close your eyes. Dot. Yo, oh, I thought it was going to be a dot. Should have been a hot dot. I'm getting flooded, so whatever. Um, pick me off real quick. All right, no, he didn't want to pick me off. All right, whatever. Yo, what, what, what is he? How is everybody dealt? Randy Moss, get picked off. Get picked off. Oh, wow. All right, good D. All right, so it's pretty much right now we're in a box, bro. Bro, it's a box, bro. Like, I'm wild. It's a box. How does he catch that through my hands, bro? All right, yo. It didn't really matter, bro. We we're down two scores. We we're definitely going to get this flood. And that it is what it is, man. We got an L and I foul. We started off fast, but it's not how you start, man. It's always how you finish. And we had to just take this L and get dotted right quick to end this game off. And uh, good game to my opponent. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. G-Miles World. One love.